Perverting the course of justice is an offense committed when a person prevents justice from being served on him, herself or on another party. In England and Wales it is a common law offense, carrying a maximum sentence of life imprisonment. Statutory versions of the offense exist in Australia, Canada, Hong Kong, Ireland, and New Zealand. The Scottish equivalent is defeating the ends of justice, while the South African counterpart is defeating or obstructing the course of justice. A similar concept, obstruction of justice, exists in United States law. Doing an act tending and intending to pervert the course of public justice is an offence under the common law of England and Wales. Perverting the course of justice can be any of three acts, also criminal are this offence, and the subject matter of the related forms of criminal conspiracy, have been referred to as, this proliferation of alternative names has been described as, somewhat confusing. This offence is also sometimes referred to as, attempting to pervert the course of justice. This is potentially misleading. An attempt to pervert the course of justice is a substantive common law offence and not an inchoate offence. It is not a form of the offence of attempt, and it would be erroneous to charge it as being contrary to Section 1 of the Criminal Attempts Act. 1981. This offence is triable only on indictment. In Canada, the equivalent offence is referred to as, obstructing justice. It is set out S 139 of the Criminal Code. 139. Everyone who willfully attempts in any manner to obstruct, pervert or defeat the course of justice in a judicial proceeding, is guilty of everyone who willfully attempts in any manner other than a manner described in subsection to obstruct, pervert or defeat the course of justice is guilty of an indictable offence and liable to imprisonment for a term not exceeding 10 years, without restricting the generality of subsection. Everyone shall be deemed willfully to attempt to obstruct pervert or defeat the course of justice who in a judicial proceeding existing or proposed in New South Wales. The equivalent offence is set out in Section 319 of the Crimes Act 1900. The maximum penalty is 14 years imprisonment. Australia